Hey everybody, how's it going? Today we got a quick review for the Spyderco Ladybug. This knife is tiny. This knife is a keychain knife. Uh, not only does it weigh half an ounce, but the handle length is under two and a half inches. So the your keys are gonna be bigger than this. Um, this particular guy is full serrations. You can get it in a full plane. It's got some stuff on the handle. I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah, let's see. This guy is about 60 bucks. Get it for like 40-ish. Uh, great little knife. It's tiny. Like these are finger grooves. That's how big fingers are gonna be like I my I can't even hold it with four fingers little like or three but it's still perfect you're not gonna you're not gonna drop this guy uh, dogs are running around sorry about that he's got a lock back this is Spyderco's FRN fiberglass reinforced nylon so again Extremely lightweight, sealed by rivets, so you can't take it apart, which is a downside for some people, but there's really no reason why you need to take this little guy apart. Um, let's see. Blade steel is VG10, which is the same as the Delica 4 here. Delica 4 is not a really big knife, but you can see it dwarfs the, uh, the ladybug there. They also make, Spyderco also makes a man bug. I'm not sure the which one's bigger. I think this is bigger. I'm not entirely sure. But, um, it's got some nice jimping too. I guess you're gonna need all the grip you can get for how small it is, but. Nice jimping here on the base of the spine of the blade as well as the top of the handle and the bottom of the handle. None in the um, finger choil or finger grooves here, but still. Great little dude. Christmas coming around, good gift. Cheap, doesn't have pocket clip, which is a little a little disappointing. I mean, it'd be a little baby pocket clip, which would be kind of cute, but you know, if you need a little knife just to put on your keychain or you know somebody who would like that to make a good gift. Well, let's see if I missed anything, so. Overall length of about 4.4 .4 inches. The blade is just under two, with the cutting edge being about an inch and a half. A little more than that. It's got the clip point blade with the hollow grind here on satin finish. I don't know if you can get this with a black finish or not. Um, you can get this in the Salt series. Uh, we do have uh, one of the Salt series, which basically the handle is yellow and it's got H1 steel which is Spyderco's very rust-resistant steel. So, handle thickness of 0.3. So, with the lock back, little spidey hole, you, you really can't flick this guy. Yeah, no, you're just gonna cut yourself. But, yeah, I think, is this one made in Japan? Yeah, Seki City, Japan. They make a couple other knives there. But, yeah. Great little knife. Great little knife for a little video. This has been the Spyderco Ladybug.